absolutely make or break for their respective aspirations. It's Liverpool, they face Manchester City, and it's live right here on EA TV. Well, I must say, this stadium falls in the must-visit category for any football fan, should the chance come his or her way. Anfield is the venue. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It is Liverpool facing Manchester City. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield would be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. Out of play for a Manchester City throw-in. Will he play it in? De Bruyne. No, high quality defending. So the table looks like this, and all very tight in the upper reaches. It's not lost on the managers how important this game is. And what a good game this should be, Derek. Two good teams and everything to play for. Let's hope both sides go for the win here today. Able to get a body in the way. And he did well to cut it out. And the advantage is with City. Really nice ball. Bernardo Silva losing out to his opponent. And news of a goal in the West Ham match. And Alex Scott has the details. Yes, it's a goal for Chelsea. They've scored the opener with 20 minutes on the clock. Thank you, Alex. Riyad Mahrez. Walker. Decent position. Well, they keep passing away. Well, honestly, I didn't mean to jinx them. Just wasn't a very good pass, finally. Well, a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Holland still on level terms moving the ball nicely and it was a good looking sequence but it comes to an end oh a lovely ball now a decent position taking care of business defensively here Kevin De Bruyne Mares chance to cross De Bruyne oh that's a really good authoritative tackle throw in here Holland potential opportunity for Manchester City to take the lead corner kick it is And taken short. Bernardo Silva. Strong but fair tackle. Diogo Jota. Arturo has it. Robertson. Good tackle. It'll be a throw. No more time left. First half is over. And so the second half gets underway. Almost a case of the two teams saying to each other, whatever you can do, I can do just as well. Calvin Phillips. Holland. 
He's using his strength to good effect. Well, it could be on for him here. Terrific save. You might say he'll be happy with some aspects of his performance so far, but not every aspect, Stuart. Well, he didn't contribute enough in that first half. I think he needs to work harder to get on the ball. He was far too static. In my view, he's got to make more runs behind this back line in the second half. Bernardo Silva. De Bruyne now. Regained possession. Can't argue with that little move. And a chance for them to nudge in front. We're making high pressing work for them here. Breaking at pace. Well, an example of a counter attack that went nowhere. Oh, moving it nicely. And on to Bellingham. And a fine cross. And it's in! 1-0! They've breached the defence. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box. Just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. So City get... The match restarted. Can they come up with an equaliser having conceded? As the stats show us, the visitors have had most of the play, but without really creating enough chances. They've almost passed the ball for the sake of it. They need to start getting it into their front players much quicker to get back into this. And goal news to bring you from the London Stadium. That means, without further ado, it's over to Alex. It's a goal for West Ham. It was all in the build-up play for me. So many different players involved. And once the space opened up, he took his chance superbly. They are now behind 2-1. Well, but tackling like that, the onus is on the referee to take action, potentially. Well, he's gone into the book. Well, he was late and he deserved a booking for that. Bernardo Silva. And reading it absolutely superbly. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. It will be decision time, the second leg of the Champions League quarter-final. And you'll see it live. Oh, he's through on goal here, Derek. Superb stop. Now we're inside the final 15 minutes. Well, apologies to Alex for having to interrupt her. Just to confirm, West Ham did find the net in that game, but they still have digging to do, trailing 2-1. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. All hands on deck. Oh, denied him brilliantly. Well, that would have wrapped it up, wouldn't it? What a brilliant save that is. And Thiago responsible for the corner. Goalkeeper's ball, it was always going to be that way. And news of a goal in the West Ham match. And Alex Scott has the details. Yes, it's a goal for Chelsea. It's now 3-1 with 80 minutes played. Thanks for the update, Alex. Erling Haaland! How about this for drama? All even once more. Astonishing! Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And the strike could not get any better. He hits through the back of the ball with such power. What a goal this is. So the ball is rolling again at one all. And it's positive from Manchester City. Is it in the cards for them to score a late winner? Electing to cross into the centre. Well, he gave it real leather, but miles off target. Oh, the keeper needed to do an awful lot better. Gundogan. 
they were playing fluent football but then the foul and now you would anticipate a yellow card and a yellow card for that Stewart and he's going to have to be careful now that was a silly challenge and clears his lines and that is that a point apiece they cannot be separate We'd like to ask you some questions about the match. Thank you for Hello from one of the great venues in world football, the Estadio Santiago Bernabeu in Madrid. I'm Derek Ray and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player. In position and still a chance. And a time for calm on the ball. And let's dissect the Real Madrid side. Thibaut Courtois is in goal. Luka Modric plays with Toni Kroos in the centre of midfield. And operating through the middle in attack today, Karim Benzema. Modric. Oh, the referee points to the spot. Penalty. Well, some might say he's been fortunate to avoid being shown the card. Well, I like that from the referee. Well, the post got in the way. Well, we know how troublesome he can be on the pitch, but what should we... A big we... moment here, Derek. Well, he tried to place that one, and given his proximity to the goal, he's bound to be disappointed. Dicing with a bit of danger here. Really good high press. Modric. Benzema seducing with his passing and tossing through. Well, not every keeper would have been that brave. Well, he read it brilliantly, didn't he? Top stuff from the keeper. Vinicius Junior could play it in the fist of the goalkeeper Thiago Alexander Arnold now delivering that deep cross and there it is the opening goal 1-0 and they'll feel they deserve it Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box, just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it. And it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. Well, it's turned into a runaway on aggregate, 4-0. Tony Kroos. On to Benzema. Federico Valverde. Vinicius Junior. Nicely timed tackle. Karim Benzema. Valverde. This is Kroos. Benzema. And offside, I rather think he was caught in two minds. Well, he just needed to go elsewhere with his pass. He showed a complete lack of awareness there. Well read to win possession back. Fabinho they were playing fluent football but then the foul and now you would anticipate a yellow card and following the infringement a caution yeah no surprise there that was always going to be a booking well lovely work to get past his man 
and Bellingham this is Thiago not a touch off the defender last of all so a corner now sending it in and danger still well a decent effort but not quite on the target Marco Asensio now with Benzema a fine reading of the situation there's a slide draw pass still a chance and I think the threat has been averted Vinicius Junior There will be one minute added on at the end. Benzema. And how about that for a save? Corner kick played in. And that is that half time here on the Spanish capital. Second and decisive leg of this Champions League quarter-final, and the second half begins. It's a high-level tackle. Brilliant. Benzema. Well, great read there to intercept. And he's lost custody of the ball here. Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. And he's fired over the corner. No trouble at all as far as the keeper was concerned. Just a quick reminder, we have more action from the Premier League coming your way. It's Liverpool facing Nottingham Forest. I'm really looking forward to that. Two entertaining teams in what should be a really feisty affair. Couldn't hang on to it. Federico Valverde now he must favour the cross Benzema can they convert tenacious tackling excellent defending there he's just got to continue his run it's got to be oh yes a goal exactly what they were looking for and he's come up with it He's beaten his man. Benzema hovering, far post. But keeper's ball. They'll be disappointed with that delivery. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. And tossing through. Oh, a save of the highest order. Well, he got his angles absolutely right. What a good save that is. Substitution for Real Madrid. I oh, couldn't really direct it where he wanted. David Alaba. And snuffing out the danger. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Jones has it. Can he put it away? 
And that's how to deal with finesse. Well, it's an easy save for the keeper. It wasn't the best option, that's for sure. Marco Asensio. Asensio. Fine cross into the middle. Not messing around with that clearance. Jones. Free kick awarded to Liverpool. They're certainly allowing their opponents to come on to them. Virgil van Dijk. Luis Diaz. He's got the right idea with that pass. Well, no real accuracy. And easy for the keeper. And so into the final five minutes. Well, that's a well-timed pass. And it goes! A three-goal cushion! This is astonishing stuff! Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. And this has become an absolute thrashing. 6-0 is the aggregate score. Well, the electronic board showing one additional minute. And there it is, the final whistle. And a victory over the two legs in this tie for Liverpool. Well, I Gracias por su atención y por tomarse su tiempo en contestar estas preguntas. Gracias otra vez.